like believe me uh, honestly I was one of the people laughing at everyone having these fucking rules and strict diet all the pregnant people like caring so fucking much what they put in their body and I was like relax you won't die from eating like cereal and then I became one of them it's always like this something that I laugh at something that I think like what's wrong with people I get the lesson and I start to understand them how they think and why they think that way I learned my lesson I got sick and now I understand the truth everything you put in your fucking body or your skin will affect you some way so I had no other choice I needed to big, do a big change okay so when I was 14 14 years old I had anorexia after that when I got well I needed to have years of not caring what I ate not caring what I trained just living my life no rules I needed to be as free as possible because I needed it never again I wanted to follow some fucking meal plan or have any rules I needed to rest my brain and just live a normal teenage life that made me well like physically mentally I really need it I recommend it to everyone especially if you easily get like addicted to beings like super perfect person and then you get an anxiety if you fail and oh my god I ate a peanut with salt and apparently peanuts uh, have mold in there and in Australia it's not even allowed to eat peanuts because it's so fucking not healthy I know a big part of me is like what the fuck shut up already like all the time people are telling us like to stop eating this and this and this and now we can't even fucking drink water because that is poison but I still like the half other part of me honestly I understand like look fucking at the store go to the store and do you see anything natural anything no everything is processed and filled with shit soybean oil additives if you check the ingredients do you know anything that's what it says it's like 20% of meat and then a long list with additives I wouldn't be this I wouldn't care a shit what I put in my body if I didn't get sick I promise you that was how I lived I enjoyed my life I ate I didn't care anything how what I ate my gut was like a strong fucking I don't know I could eat anything in like the biggest amounts without getting any symptoms and then years later I got fucked up in my face and I got this all disease I needed to do a big change think about everything I can do to change do it for myself I want to live a healthy life and maybe when I cured I can maybe start using additives again and now I'm fucking doing this I only live once so that is why we need to take care of that life like isn't it I think it's so stupid that Okay, I was one of them thinking, we only live a lot, a lot once, so I want to enjoy this life. I was one of them. And I know every, my old friends are like that. It's nothing wrong with that. But I learned my lesson. I got sick. I understand. I can't just throw my life like in the sea and thinking I will survive. So I'm definitely not doing this for, to, for my body or something like that. I'm already shredded, I don't need and I don't care about that. What I care about my, is my health. And I wanna live long and I wanna feel good. I know that. Every day I wake up and I feel good is fucking a gratefulness. So I need to check what I put in my body and what I put on my skin. Because seriously, you need to really think what are you eating and what are you putting in yourself because everything will affect you somehow mentally or physically or gut or everything because basically you don't fucking need to avoid like carbs or fats or protein animals milk whatever no 
that is the healthiest thing. We all need all of those sources. It's really important, seriously. If you skip one of them, like only eat meat, like carnivore, that is not healthy either. You don't need, need to be like super, super, super weird and do everything like overreact. What you just need is to check that everything is natural and clean and not buy these fucking processed uh, diets, vegan, processed additives, toxic, antibiotic filled, imported stuff.